Another method of multiplying binomials together rather than FOIL is what I call the long multiplication method and it looks like this. So let's say I have two binomials that I'm multiplying together 9x plus 9 times the quantity 3x plus 3. I can simply put the 9x plus 9 in this position times, and I put a little circle around that to distinguish that from x, 3x plus 3 goes right underneath it with a line like so and then I multiply the last two terms 3 times 9 which is a positive 27. Now I'm going to take the last term of the binomial underneath now and multiply it by the first term of the one above. So I go 3 times 9x which gives me a plus 27x. Just like in long multiplication now I'm going to go to the next term to the left on the binomial on the bottom and now multiply that diagonally by the last term of the, of the binomial above. So I go 3x times 9 which is also 27x. Notice that I put that 27x right underneath the other one. So the x terms align themselves right underneath. Then I go 3x times 9x which is 27x squared. And now I go ahead and put an additional line, addition line there. And now I simply add the columns. So I have 27x squared plus 54x plus 27. The added benefit of this is that your like terms are directly underneath each other and it's easy to add columns. Let me give you a further example. What if I were to take x squared times 5x plus 6, so that's a trinomial, and then I were to multiply that by a binomial, let's say x plus 2. Okay, if I follow the same procedure, I'm now going to take each of the terms of the trinomial above and multiply it by the 2. So I go 2 times 6 is a positive 12, 2 times 5x is a positive 10x, and 2 times x squared is a positive 2x squared. Now, Looking at the first term of the binomial underneath, I'm now going to multiply each of the terms of the trinomial above by that x term. So I go x times x, x times 6, which gives us 6x. I go x times 5x, which gives us a 5x squared. And I go x times x squared, which gives me an x cubed. My sum line right underneath, and again, Notice that I put the like terms directly underneath each other. So now when I go to add the like terms, I can simply add the columns. So here I have x cubed plus 7x squared plus 16x plus 12. And I'm done. So in this case, 9x plus 9 times 3x plus 3 is equal to 27x squared plus 54x plus 27 and x squared plus 5x plus 6 times x plus 2 is equal to x cubed plus 7x squared plus 16x plus 12.